In a world where five students are handed an assignment over the road to revolution, instead of a boring PowerPoint, they decided to do this. The Sugar Act was a tax that went into effect on April 5th, 1764. The tax charged three cents on refined sugars and increased taxes on coffee, indigo, and on certain types of wine. The act was unfair in more ways than one. Not only did it ban imported rum and French wine, it also only affected certain parts of the population. That's all I have. Okay. Get out. So unfair. <laughs> the Stamp Act was the first direct act on American colonies. It was instituted in the Hello. month of November 1765, which basically uh, yeah. meant Sir, that all the paper pay pamphlets and other public and pay legal documents had to have a stamp or British more. seal of approval on it. A similar act give me more, give me more, we need more than that. Years. But when they oh, passed yeah. a similar law in the Americas, me, they Stop really got it. the colonists upset. <laughs> you can't do all my money. Oh wait, no, I still have some here. <laughs> the Currency Act passed the law in 1764. This act plunged the colonies into a depression by cutting money. off the businesses the that expanded oh, yeah. rapidly in the colonies which were producing small what fortunes for the business owners. I'm not gonna accept what? this. What? Give me real money. Real money. Look, this what? is real money, sir. What? What? It, Give me I, that. I don't, have I don't want this that. cheap paper. No, 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 no. Give me that. You don't understand. This this is good. See? That's this real is, money. This, this, this can get you No, money. don't give this me this good. junk. This is no, rubbish. No, Give me the good. real deal, boy. It's good. It's good. No, what? Why are you resort to Pay violence? your taxes with real money next time. It's real money. The Tea Act, passed by Parliament on May 10th, 1773, would launch the final spark to the revolutionary movement in Boston. The act was not intended to raise revenue in the American colonies, and in fact imposed no new taxes. It was designed to prop up the East India Company, which was floundering financially and burdened with 18 million pounds of unsold tea. This tea was to be shipped directly to the colonies and sold at the sold at a bargain price. Cargoes of the tea filled the harbor. The British ships' crews were stalled in Boston, looking for work and often finding trouble. This situation led to the Boston Tea Party. The Boston Tea Party was the raid on three ship, British ships in the Boston Harbor on December 16, 1773, in which Boston colonists disguised as Indians threw the contents of several hundred chests of tea into the harbor. Whoa! Go America! Yeah! Yeah! Forward! Woo! America! We got We're gonna this. throw this tea! We got this! We're gonna throw this tea! Keep going! Tea. <gasps> More! Throw more overboard. We're gonna we're gonna piss Throw off more. some Britons and he he. We're Indians oh, and we're throwing yeah. tea. <laughs> Dang, look at that tea. Oh, destroy it destroy all. The tea. Oh. Destroy the tea. Yeah. Destroy everything with tea. Oh. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Keep we're, going. We're Indians. Oh. <laughs> destroy the tea. Yeah. Destroy the tea. More. Is there more? Oh, Destroy oh, it all! Throw it all over! Oh, oh, oh. Yeah! We're oh. in here! This show the teas! Come on! This show the tea! Yeah. <gasps> Throw it all the over, boy! Everything! Throw everything! No tea! Throw Let's everything! Let's see if I'm this! Wow! <laughs> Throw the tea now. Throw it. All of it. Throw it. All of it over. Not a single. Nah. Oh. Yeah. America. Throw the tea. Yeah. Yeah. yeah throw that tea, boy.
<laughs> Look at it go. Look at that. Dude. Yeah. Mm. Mm. The Boston Massacre occurred on a Monday night in March 5, 1770. Most of the colonists who were part of the scheme were drunk, which made them get angry at the British, British officers. One thing led to another, and a small mob of colonists started shouting at get a few here, British officers. Backs. We don't want you here. Leave us alone. Land. Let us be. Let us be. Get out of Eventually, here. Eventually, 11 ah. British officers were backed down to a corner by the angry mob, and this was one of the main factors that started the American Revolution. The Boston Port Act was created on March 31, 1774, but didn't take effect until June 1, 1774. The Boston Port Act was a reaction for the Boston Tea Party. This act shut down Boston harbors for purpose of trade. It will remain in effect until Boston paid East India Company for their lost tea. Driving my boat. Can I come in? Oh, hold up. Can I? Can I? Please? No! No, get out of here! I refuse your supplies! Go! Why? <laughs> Who's on this ship over here? I might want to investigate this. Let's see. Oh, I hear he's from British. Hello, my fellow Briton. Why are you here? Come on, bring your supplies. Let's go. Hurry up, man. You're taking forever. The Administration of Justice Act took effect on May 20th, 1774. This act made it so British soldiers could not be tried in colonial courts. What are you doing? Do what I want. Do what I want. No. No. Get it. You know what? I'm tired of you. I'm tired of you. All your nonsense. No, 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 no. You're right. Bye. Oh, my beloved. The Massachusetts Governing Act also took effect on May 20th, 1774. The Massachusetts Governing Act was established to put an end to the Constitution of Massachusetts. It also made it only one town meeting per year in Massachusetts on this approved by the government. Town officials will be appointed by the royal government instead of being elected. And the executive council will no longer be elected but appointed by king. What's this meeting about? It's about how you're all having more than one a year. You hear me? Only You can only have one now. Only one a year. What? What? No. What? What? No. No. It's... No. Why? Because this you know Yamaha are gonna grow too you know powerful. What? I don't care about you. I'm gonna punch you on the forehead. I'm gonna run away. And screw you. Bye. The Quartering Act took effect on June 2nd, 1774. This act forced colonial governments to provide supplies and housing to British soldiers stationed in the colonies. So, I'm just walking in. Hey there. Hey there, husband. So, who's coming over? I don't know yet. Oh, I can just throw our bread because I make so much of it. I big baller with bread. Just like... Look, you want some bread? You want some bread? Here, oh, take it. Fine, take my damn bread. Screw this party right now. I don't like you right anymore. Yeah, you better give me that bread, honey. Come here, lady. No. We're going upstairs right now. Why? Why? Please don't. Please. Oh, uh, you you go in bed right now. I'm going to show you who's boss. Uh, please don't hurt me. <laughs> I just lost my manly hurt. 
my wife, my poor, poor wife. I'm gonna get revenge someday. One day. The Quebec Act took effect on June 22, 1774. The Quebec Act was put in effect to extend the boundaries of Quebec and guarantee religious freedom my land. to Catholics. I got something Canadians. to say to you, please. Even though this act wasn't related to the punishment of the Boston oh, Tea Party, it there. was seen as a threat to the okay, liberty and expansion of the colonies. Get my glasses on. So, oh, there we go. Oh, ooh, what? Yippee! It's bigger than I thought. We no. got more land. Yay! No, I want it back. Yippee! It's no, so you better give it back, Fun or else here. something bad oh, is gonna you happen. You just hit a priest by the name of God. I, uh, I, I curse you. Uh, die, you demon! Die, you demon! No! <laughs> Nobody messes with Jesus, boy. This event led to the revolution. Yeah. Wait, can we reset the <laughs> Can we reset the whole map? Or it's gone lost? Um, I can, I can do it, but like... <laughs> don't do this again. <laughs> like, half the town is gonna be gone. You ain't gonna kill me. Oh! <laughs> Oh, I hear an airplane. Nope. Nope. <laughs> nope. I'm not oh. say no. We need to get work done. <laughs> oh, when did you decide that we should get work done? Uh, whenever I realize the town is blowing up yeah, and on okay. fire. Ready? Five, four, three, two, shoot him. Uh, you're a man. I'm my skin, I'm a woman. You're, you're a man. You're a man. Hold up. <coughs> you're a man. Um, you're still a man. <laughs> you're still Are a you man. Are sure? Um... It's a dude! She's hideous. <laughs> it's a dude! I've already been through two girls, screw you.